Well, hi, my name is Don. I have a 2001 PT Cruiser. And I want to do a review of um, this roof rack that I bought for it. I, um, I went on my camping trip and um, the roof rack worked out really well. I was looking for um, some roof racks and I don't know, they said Yukami and some other um, brands uh, uh, for the roof racks. And one was like um, four, like five hundred and fifty dollars and four hundred. And one was one hundred and fifty. But they said, well, th the doors don't shut though, you know. And so and I'm like, I was gonna try and make my own roof rack you know just make my own I'm like well heck I'm a machinist I should be able to figure out how to make a roof rack you know tool and die as I go like, oh, maybe I could have but um but then I just happened to be going through the pages or the the internet looking for roof racks and and I came across this one where you, where you secure the um To secure the roof rack, you're using like uh, seat belts, you know, just like I'm um, going right through, right through the top of your car, you know, like here. Here I got them. Well, here like little straps where you go right through the um the door jams of your car you know through the um and it's not through the windows it's through the door so you could open and shut your doors it's fine and it's just a little strap but the strap seems a little cheapy but I don't know, I, was, I never had to retighten them once. I put it on, and I had them on for like about two weeks. About a week and a half, two weeks. Never retightened them once. And the, the, the nice thing that. that I noticed about it was um, you can sit in the car. And they are just they're right above your head, you know. So it's really, you know, not um, not a big deal. Here's my head, and here's a strap. It's up here, and it goes across. This part was by me, kind of hit my head just a little bit on here. But, um, I mean, it's, it's not inconvenient at all. I mean, you know, it's right above your head. I mean, it's not, I mean, it's not bad. And then it just goes around. They said that, um, they might leak if it was raining. So I, I tried to, um, devise my own method of, um, putting some, some, weather stripping here just in case put on with duct tape but but yeah see it just comes on and then I, I took up board and I I put some uh, I drilled holes in it I think every eight inches or something like that so I could wrap um, rope around it I had rope around it too and then I had I got these um, these clamps not clamps but um, things where you secure the cargo with and I had it just put a tarp on it you know over the top and you could make a waterproof if you really wanted to oh, and I'd, I we it didn't rain so I don't know how well it worked in the rain but um, but it worked all right and then you just pull them tight but these just, you know, sit there and there, there's a bar. I got the, the one that's, um, I think, uh, 44 
to 50 or something like that. It's the, um, I guess this says Rage Power Sport Products TRCB4460-U. That's the one I got. But, um, see, and here's the picture if you ever see it. I, those are on the internet. See, they got the straps on there like that. And you just pull it tight, just like the picture. And they just put it on your car and you put them where you want. It's not um, specifically made for any individual car, so they will work for various cars. And I, I, yeah, I think it worked very well. It didn't move around. And um, then I, I tied this. This I made. I tied it to the roof so I could I put a piece of plywood because I didn't want my stuff to get wet because I went and put my tent on top of it and it was smaller than than the bars so it would just kind of just fit right through the middle so I'm like well that's that sucks so so I cut a piece of plywood and put it up put holes in it as you can see here I put um, holes in it hold I drilled some holes in it so I could strap rope around it I took this rope, that rope right there, and I strapped around the, I mean, I, mean, I, I worked it around over the, um, what I already had just to secure it better. And actually, it worked out really well. So, I just, um, I want to do a little view on this thing. It's a super fit roof bar carrier. Not really sure. I mean, so I got this at Walmart.com for like fifty-two dollars, and um, it work, works great. I mean, I like it. I think it's awesome. I mean, I'm not sure how how strong that your little strap is there, but maybe it could be a little stronger. I kind of worry about that breaking off. But, but um, all in all, I think it's a, a really Really nice um, roof rack, and so if um, you ever need a roof rack, if you're looking for a roof rack for the PT Cruiser, then um, try this one out. You know. Rather than, I mean, 52 bucks, you can't complain. I mean, I mean it, it worked. It worked. It's, it done its job. So I'm glad I bought them. So anyway, thanks a lot, and I uh, hope you liked the video. And if you're looking for a roof rack, try this one. might work for you. Okay, all right. See you later. Okay, bye. Hope this helped you out I'm sure maybe it did because it sure helped me out getting a roof rack for my car because a lot of them are are custom made for individual cars and there's not very many for the PT Cruiser that I noticed but anyway that's about it thanks a lot okay bye bye See you later, bye-bye.